angel is saying to you, God is talking to you today, my dear child. I know how hard things are for you. I see the stress you're under, the pain in your heart, and the fears that keep you up at night. At night and the worries that keep you up at night, remember that you are not by yourself. I will always be with you. I see every tear you shed. Cry for help. I hear every prayer you say and answer it when it's time. Sure, trust me. I'm the Lord your God, and I have you in the palm of my hand. It's the right time, and I know that the plans I have for you will work out. Plans to give you hope and a future, not to hurt you. Even when it's not clear what to do and the road ahead looks scary, have faith that I will help you. Each and every time when life gets too hard and you want to give up, don't give up. Know that I am your strength and that I will never leave you or nod off. I am your safe haven and fortress, always there to help you in times of danger. Lean on me, because I'm your rock and your savior through all of your troubles. They're not meant to break you. They're meant to build you up. I'm making you better and more like the person I made you to be, just like gold is. You are being cleaned by the fires of life, just as fire cleans things. Don't let failures get you down. They are just stepping stones to your victory. I have great things planned for you. Don't be afraid of what the future holds. I'm already there. Trust in my love, because it will never fail. My kindness and power are enough for you, is made perfect in your weakness. When you're having doubts, look to me because I am your source of comfort and peace. Trust that I am putting everything together. I am working for your good even when you can't see it, planning every part of your life for a reason bigger than you can imagine. Imagine and hold on to hope, because a new day is coming. It's time to cry. The hard times are over, and a happy time is coming. Lift your eyes to the sky. Help comes from me, who made heaven and earth. I am your cure, provider, your savior. Throw all your worries on me, because I care about you. Deeply let go of the past and welcome the future I've planned for you. During the quiet times when the world is still, know that I am God. Listen for my voice. I'm saying words of love, support, and direction to your heart, and let my peace wash over you, making you feel better and easing your fears. Spiritually, you are my beloved child, and I will always love you. I love you, and nothing can separate us. Not trouble, not stress, not famine, not danger, not even punishment. Death, you have already won because of Christ, who loves you just the way you are. As you go through life, know that I am always with you. If you walk through a hollow, I will move the mountains back into place. Your light when storms come, and I'll be your take refuge in me. Trust me because I am honest and faithful. Stand strong in your faith. I will fight for you even though the battle is not mine, because I know I am fighting for you. I will win because I am the Lord your God. Happy celebrations. I am making everything new. The best is yet to come. May all of my gifts overflow into your life and fill you with happiness, peace, and hope. Follow my love. Live by my kindness and believe what I say. I am with you now, and always, amen. I see your hopes and dreams in your heart. I put them there for a reason, and I will see them through to the end. Good work I started in. You don't get tired of doing good for at the right time. If you don't give up waiting, my child, you will reap a harvest in due time. I have a special plan for everything but you may not understand why certain things are going on, 
but trust that my ways are better than yours, and thoughts are more important than yours, and what seems like a weight is. A lot of the time, what looks like a loss is actually a way to make things better. Come back and keep your faith, because I am changing your trials into testimonies. Turn your pain into something useful when you're alone. To me, because I am your source of power, courage, and knowledge. Heart, and you'll find me. I can't wait to tell you my secrets, and let my word be a light to lead you in the right direction, your feet and a light to your way. Think about my words, because they are true and eternal. Don't let fear stop you. I have not given you a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. Believe that I am with you and that I have given you what you need. You have everything you need to make your dreams come true. Trust in your skills and I've given you special skills, and you should use them for my praise. Spend time with people who make you feel good and push you to be a light in the darkness. Of hope to the people around you, love and care for others like I have. To you, helping other people will bring you happiness and satisfaction. Remember that you are my, forgive those who have hurt you and let go of them in this world. Keeping any anger or unforgiveness in your heart will only get in the way of your own freedom and growth, and as you forgive, you will help me heal. Get better in ways you never thought possible. Let go of old hurts and accept the changes I'm making in your life. You are not limited by, you are a new person in Christ, so don't worry about past mistakes or failures. Passed away took comfort in who you are in me, for you are fearfully and wonderfully built your faith that you are my beloved chosen and saved when problems come up. Praise me in the middle of a storm. Honor changes. It changes the mood and connects your heart with mine. It lets you do miracles and big steps forward. Keep an attitude of thanks. It will help you get through the worst of times. Count your gifts and you'll see how good I am. I am setting a table for you in front of your friends and family. I am putting oil on your head, enemies, and your cup of goodness and kindness will surely follow you all the days of your life. Trust me, because I am Jehovah Jir, your provider, and I will give you everything you need. Your needs based on my wealth and glory rest in my presence, for you are in me, will find real peace and rest. Put your problems at my feet, and I will take care of them. Do not worry about your soul. My yoke is light and my bearing is easy. Take some time to be still. Remember that I am God. In, in the quiet times you will hear, my still, small voice will lead you and calm you. Remember that nothing is impossible for me because I am the God of miracles and I can make anything happen. Keep your eyes on Jesus, the author and finisher, for your own good. Of your faith, keep going in the race that was set out for you, knowing that I am with you every step of the way. Be happy because your success is on the way. I will keep the promises I made to you. Don't give up hope. I am the God of hope and I am starting a new journey in your life. Be ready for big things. Things will get better soon. My plans for you are to make you happy, not sad. May my peace, which is greater than all peace, give you hope and a future. Understand and keep your heart and mind safe in Christ Jesus. May my love surround you. You, my grace will keep you and my joy will fill you. Walk with the confidence that I am with you. Thanks for everything until the end of time. Amen. Good luck on your trip. Remember that I am always with you. I am the shepherd who leads you. 
Next to still waters and heals your spirit even as you walk through the be brave in the deepest valleys, because I am with you. My rod and staff will comfort you and keep you safe. I am your good shepherd, and I will never leave you. Know that every move you make and choice you make is being planned by me. Steps. Trust that I will show you the way. I know it better than you do. If you ask me for advice, I'll give it to you for free. Don't rely on your own knowledge, but whenever you need help, just let me know, and I'll make your way clear. If you're not sure what to do, keep your heart still and listen to my voice. I'm talking to you through the wind. See, the beauty of my voice brings peace, clarity, and the stillness of your spirit direction. Pay close attention to where I lead you. I'm taking you to places of plenty and blessing. Don't be crushed by the problems you face. They're not meant to be that way. Not to beat you, but to make you stronger, like an eagle soars above a storm. You will also rise above your problems and spread your wings of trust. And believe in me, I will take you further than you thought possible. My child, you will never be alone because I have put my spirit inside you, and he is always with you. The Holy Spirit is your. He will be your guide, your protector, and your helper. He will teach you everything. Remember everything I told you, and lean on him. He will give you strength to live a victorious life. When you're tired, come to me and I'll give you you rest in me. My presence is a safe place where you can find peace and rebirth. Don't come with extra work that you don't need to do. My feet, and I'll let you rest. Trust that I will take care of you and your needs because I am. As you move forward, Ward, your loving Father wants you to accept the change, to work in your life. The old you is gone, and the new you is here getting refreshed every day. Let my spirit work in you to make you this journey is a process, and I'll be with you every step of the way. Along the way, enjoy the little wins because they show that you're making progress. Honor. Every step you take, no matter how small, is a step toward the promises kept. Be happy with the progress you make and don't hate the days of small starts. Big things come together, one step at a time. I'm opening doors. I will open doors that no one else can open and close them at the right time. And my plan for what to do when one door closes is because I'm getting ready to open a better one. So don't let closed doors stop you. I look forward to the new chances I'll bring your way and stay in touch with prayer and service are the things that keep you rooted in my life. Love and prayer based on my truth are the best ways to connect with other people. Talk to me, a place where you can pour out your heart and I'll listen for my answer is prayer, which is your act of giving up and a statement of how great I am and your faith in my power shine a light on the world, show my love and kindness to those around you. Your life is proof of my goodness. Let your light shine so that other people can see your good works. Praise your Father in heaven, for you are my messenger bringing the message of grace and hope to a world that needs it. In times of doubt, remember my, they are promises that you can keep. I promise I will never break my word, returns empty, but does what I want it to do and serves its purpose, which I sent you, keep my promises. They will help you weather the storms of life. Know that I am always working for your good, even when you, you can't see it, but I'm working behind the scenes to make sure. Your life. Trust in my plan, because it's good, pleasing, and right. You into a future full of hope, promise, and joy. May you walk in all of it, to enjoy my love and joy through my gifts of peace 
and may you be filled with the knowledge of my will that bears fruit in all your good work. May your heart be boosted with all the power that is to my wonderful power, so that you can be very strong and patient. Happy celebration! I am your God, and you are my beloved child. I love you, and I am proud of you. I am proud of you. Keep walking with faith, hope, and love, and know that I am with you. Always with you. You are important to me, and nothing can ever take you away. I want you to remember that, my love. Amen. You were fearfully and wonderfully made. You were made with a reason. Before you were born, I knew your fate and set you apart in every way. Every little part of your life has been carefully woven into the big fabric of my life. Divine plan, dear. As you go through the different stages of your life, remember that I wrote your whole story, every chapter, line, and word. Ed was carefully written by me, so trust the story I'm writing for you, even when the story isn't clear or the pages are full of problems to solve. If the weight of your tasks is too much for you, come to me. Your safety and power, a help in times of trouble and the thing you should worry about the most. I care about you, so take my load and learn from me. Be kind and humble and your spirit will find rest. Be strong. Be brave. Don't be scared or down, because I am with you wherever you go. The trip may be long, but I am with you. Even though the road may be rough, I will be with you the whole way. If you walk through the fire, you won't get burned. Set fire to it because I am the Lord your God and the Holy One of Israel, your Savior. May my peace, a peace that goes beyond understanding, fill your heart. Peace comes from me, not from the world. It will keep your hearts and minds safe. In the middle of all the trouble and chaos, may my peace be with you in Christ Jesus. Hold on to me, because I have beaten the world. When you're down, remember this, that I am Jehovah Jir, your provider, and I will meet all of your needs. I am rich in praise in Christ Jesus. Don't worry about your life, what you will eat or drink, or how you will take care of your body. The body is more than just clothes and food. Just look at the birds, the air they don't plant, harvest, or store in barns, but I feed them. You're not much more important than they are. Let your faith be a shield that stops everything. When the evil one fires an arrow, it hits the defense of God with the belt of truth around your waist and holds the breastplate of justice in place. And give your feet the readiness that comes from the word of, take up the shield of faith, the helmet of safety, and the sword of the Spirit, which is my word. Serve others with a humble heart, for the best among you will serve you. Let your light shine so that other people can see. Your good acts and praise from your Father in heaven for serving you. Give freely to find happiness and satisfaction. When you face trials of many kinds, remember to love without conditions and forgive without conditions. It brings you great joy because you know that trying your faith makes you stronger. Perseverance. Let perseverance do its job so that you can grow up. You're not missing anything, and every trial you go through is making you into the stay linked to me, the true vine, and be the person I made you to be. Me and I will stay with you. Just like a tree can't bear fruit by itself, it can't bear fruit unless it stays on the vine, and you can't either unless you stay in, stay with me in my love, and let my word speak. Believe in yourself and ask for anything you want. It will be done for you. Keep your eyes open. Set your mind on things above instead of things on earth for the eternal goal. You died, and now your life is hidden with Christ in God. 
When your life shows up, you'll show up with him in glory and keep your eyes on Jesus the pioneer as you run the race that was set out for you and builder of faith. Know that I love you and am happy for you. You have been picked to be holy and loved very much. Dress yourself in compassion. Being kind, humble, gentle, and patient with each other is important. Forgive each other, and on top of all these good traits, put on love, which holds them all together. As one, go out into the world with my love, grace, and power. I am with you. As you walk into old age, always know that you'll be there for them. You are mine and I am yours. You will never be alone because I will always be with you. More amen, my dear child. As you go through the days to come, always remember to show that I will always be with you. I go ahead and get the I'm your back guard and I'll walk with you to help and guide you. Trust me to keep you safe from the past that wants to hold you back. Being everywhere at once and taking comfort in knowing that I am always with you. Afraid to dream big and go after the things I want you to have. I am the one who gives dreams and makes them come true. Promise that I will finish what I started in you, even if the road seems long. If things get hard, don't give up hope. Your goals are part of my divine plan, and I am faithful to see them through even when things get hard. Failures and setbacks don't give up. These are chances to grow and get better. Just like a potter shapes clay, I'm shaping you into a vessel of honor. Accept the procedure because it is through the tests that you're in your time of prayer, your character gets stronger and your faith grows stronger. Not just a tradition, but a connection. It's a time to come together and closeness with me. Let your worship be a sweet one that pleases me. Good in my eyes and in worship you will find renewal for your heart. To keep your soul strong, pay attention to your thoughts, because they shape your... In fact, think about things that are true, good, pure, beautiful, and admirable. Wonderful and honorable, let the renewing of your mind change you, so that you can understand my good, pleasing, and perfect will. Keep your heart, for it is the source of life. Help those who are in need. You serve me by being the hands and feet of my love in a world that hurts. Be kind to strangers. Comfort those who are grieving and give hope to those who are. You follow my order to love each other, even though it's hopeless to do so. Keep your feet on my word. It is a lamp to your feet and a light to your way. Think about it day and night and let it abide deeply in you. It is alive and well. It cuts through even the most solid things sharper than any double-edged sword. Soul and spirit meet in the marrow, and it decides what people think and feel. Heart and pray without stopping. Prayer is your lifeline and straight link to God. For me, prayer is how you connect your heart to mine and tap into my power. Bring your request to me with thanksgiving and God's peace. Our all-powerful God will keep your hearts and minds safe in Christ Jesus. Be humble and know this. Every great and good gift comes from above. But pride comes before destruction. Honor comes from being humble. Help others without expecting anything in return. You will find real fame and honor in my kingdom if you are humble. When you're tired, rest in me. I am your refuge and your strength. Who are tired and weighed down, I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you. I am kind and humble, so learn from me, and you will find rest for your to all souls. Know that you are my light and easy yoke. As an ambassador for me, please let your life show how much I love you. Thank you for your kindness and mercy. 
Be a light in a dark world and a vessel of hope for the feeling hopeless. Your life shows how good and reliable I am. Keep going. Keep going toward the goal to win the prize I've called you to in heaven through Christ Jesus. Forget about what's behind you and push yourself toward what's ahead. Keep going in the race and keep your eyes on give thanks to Jesus, who started and finished your faith. Thankfulness opens the door to my gifts. A grateful heart sees my hand at work in all situations, good and bad. Rejoice always, for I am with you. Everything is going well for you because of me and you. May my love bring you joy and peace. Fill your heart with my kindness and let my spirit guide you. May my presence be with you, your constant friend. Walk with the peace of mind that comes from knowing you are deeply loved and greatly blessed. My sweet child, I love you so much. Go out in my power and peace. As long as I live, my love, I will be with you. Walk in with the promise that you are mine and I am yours. You will never be alone because I am with you, you now and always. Amen. My dear child, as you keep reading this on your journey, hold on to the truth that I am your base at all times. Whether your life is full of joy or trouble, build it on the rock of my word. You will be able to stand strong even when storms and winds blow. It is strong and can't be broken. Let your life show how much my kindness and mercy have changed you. Your deeds shine a bright light in a world that needs hope so badly. Your words and love show that I'm with you. Be the salt of the land, adding taste and longevity to everything you come across when you're facing fears and worries. Keep in mind that I am your promise. Do not let the lies of the enemy take root in your heart and hold on to my words, because they are true. I have not given you a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a, if you have a clear head, you are more than a victor. Enjoy the quiet times, thought, because that's when you'll hear my words the clearest. Without a doubt, I am talking to you in the whispers of your heart, putting you at ease and teaching you, be still and know that I am God. You can find power and direction in the quiet. Take in the beauty of my, the mountains, the seas, and the stars in the sky are all God's work. Praise my greatness and majesty, and let the wonders of creation remind you of me. Power and imagination, you are a part of this wonderful world I have made made you fearfully and wonderfully in times of plenty and times of need. Hold on to your faith. I am Jehovah Jir, your protector, and I will meet all your needs, needs based on my wealth and glory. Trust that I will provide even when you, there's no way to get there. I'll show you the way. I'm your shepherd. Also, still waters, be honest and live out your faith with, Tell the truth in an honest way. Let your yes be yes, and your no be no. Be honest in what you say and do when you talk about love. Trust and respect, and it makes me very happy to seek justice, love mercy, and walk. Be humble before your God. Stand up for what's right. Protect the weak, and show kindness to those in need. In that way, you show my heart. For everyone to see, your acts of kindness and justice are a strong proof of my love. Stay linked to the body of Christ and make friends with other Christians is important for your growth and motivation. Together, you're stronger, being able to carry each other's burdens and enjoy each other's win. The church is my bride and I love her very much in every choice. If you really want to find me, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Know that my plans for you are good and will help you, not hurt you. Plans to hurt you, plans to give you hope and a future. 
Trust me to lead you because I know on your way you should forgive as I have forgiven you. Don't hold on to anger or anger toward them because it will only hurt your soul. Forgiveness frees you. As I've shown you grace, show that grace to others as well. It's to forgive you. You'll find real peace. When you feel weak, know that my strength is made perfect in your weakness. My grace is enough for you. Don't depend on anything else, on your own skills, but trust that my power working through you will keep you going, love you and give you the strength to get through everything. Love is the biggest commandment, and I love you no matter what. Being a true disciple means letting your love be real. Love that is gentle and kind never fails, and it's the best proof that I'm here. Remember that I am the God of hope, even when things look the worst. At times like these, let hope hold you up. I am working everything out for the best. My future is in my hands because you trust me to know when and how to do everything just right. And it is full of hope for my beloved child. Please keep trusting me. Love and presence that never changes. Know that I am your shield and defender. I am always there to help you when things are going wrong and the world seems... If you're not sure, hold on to the promises I make. I am the same today as I was yesterday, always and forever. As you try to make sense of life's challenges, seek knowledge above all else. I share your knowledge with anyone who asks for it and don't just rely on your own. I understand, but please honor me in every way, and I will show you the way. Let my word be a light for your feet and a lamp for your path. Being humble is the way to real fame. So bow down under my strong hand and I'll help you get back on your feet when the time is right. Being humble is an honor. Listen quickly, speak slowly, and become slow. Whenever you feel angry, Keep your heart soft and your mind open to learning. Love Love is the most important thing in my life, and the fifth rule. Everyone will know that you love your friend as much as you love yourself and those who you hate. That you are my followers if you love each other. Let your love show to my being in your life. Remember how powerful your words are. Death and life are. When you speak, use words that strengthen, encourage, and bring. Let your words always be kind and seasoned with salt to heal. Tell the truth in love and let my love and knowledge show in what you say. Don't worry about anything. Instead, use prayer and petition in every scenario. With thanksgiving, send me your prayers and my peace, which goes beyond all else. Your hearts and minds will be safe in Christ Jesus because you understand. Heart at ease knowing I'm in charge of helping other people without expecting anything in return, like my son did when he came not to be served but to serve. Look for ways to bless the people around you by helping them. Do good things for me. Don't get tired of them, because at the right time you will get what you want if you don't give up. Find strength in the people around you. You are part of the body of Christ and are stronger when you work together. Worries, pray for each other, and cheer each other on. Do not leave each other. People get together because there is strength and support in fellowship. Hold on to your faith, even when things get hard. Your faith is more valuable than anything else. These trials are worse than gold, which dies even after being heated and cooled, improving you, making your faith stronger and bringing you closer to me. Rejoice in your pains, knowing that suffering makes people more determined and strong. Character hope when you're not sure. Remember that I have been loyal to you and have been with you through all of your life stages. Look back and see how I've led you cared for you, and kept you safe. 
My loyalty in the past will fuel your faith in the future. Be a peacemaker in a world of there will be peace, and those who make it will be called children of God. Find peace and go after it. Let your life show that the peace I offer is real. Be an agent of my peace in your town and around the world through the people you know. Value the moments of rest that come to me, all you tired and heavy-laden people, and I will help you rest. Taking some time to be still, listen, and rest your soul in rest will help you feel better and give you strength for the trip ahead. Have faith in my care. I am Jehovah Jir, and I will meet all your needs, needs based on my wealth and glory. Don't worry about tomorrow because tomorrow will take care of itself. Will think about itself every day and have enough trouble of its own to rest, assured that I am taking care of you. Think about my kindness. Enough for you. My strength is made perfect in weakness, so don't try too hard. In your own power, but trust in my grace. You were saved by grace, through faith. This is not your own doing. It is God's gift to you. Grace be with you, keep you going, and give you strength as you go. Let your life be a living sacrifice that is holy and pleasing to me. This is your true and right way to do things. Faith doesn't follow the rules of this world, but be changed by the, if you renew your mind, you will be able to try and agree with what my will is. My lovely and perfect will go out into the world in my love, grace, and will. Strength, I will always be with you until the end of the age. Walk with the hope that you know you are loved by me and I am loved by you. I will always be with you, so you will never be alone. More. Amen. You are my creation that I made in Christ Jesus. Do the good things I planned ahead of time for you. Your trip is unique, and I'll be with you every step of the way. Take the way I've shown you with faith and trust that I will lead you. I am the God of clarity, so don't be afraid when you face times of confusion. Direction Look for my face, and I'll light your way. Trust in the gentle nudges from the Holy Spirit, because He is your counselor and guide and will lead you into all truth and show you the way, but don't forget to grow a heart of thanksgiving in all situations. This is what I'm thankful for. Give thanks because it changes the way you see things and helps you see all the many ways I have blessed you. Let thanksgiving be a yearly event giving from your heart as you face each one's difficulties. Day, don't depend on your own power alone. My grace is enough for you. My strength is made perfect by your weakness. Lean on me when you feel like you can't handle it. I am your shelter and fortress. I am always there to help you when you are in trouble. Remember to keep your mind on the eternal instead of the short term. Things in heaven, not on earth, because what we see is only temporary, but what is unseen is timeless. So live with an eternal view and know that your real home is there, is in heaven with me. Let this hope hold you up and guide your deeds. Be careful as you walk with me. Read my word and let it fill you up. It's alive and well, and it's sharper than any two-edged sword. It will lead you. My word will correct you and give you the tools you need for every good job and a light to guide you through good times and bad. Know that I am with you. Be happy with people who are happy and sad with people who are sad. Help and comfort other people by sharing your own worries and joys. Show my love and kindness in everything you do. Keep your heart safe for Keep it pure and in line with my will. Everything you do comes from it. Traps and distractions in the world that want to take your attention away from me on what is true, noble, right, pure, lovely, 
and excellent. Let these things fill your heart and mind. Walk in the freedom I've given you. It's for freedom that, since Christ has set you free, don't let anything hold you back. God has set you free from sin's chains and made you a child of God. Accept who you are and live in the freedom and success that are yours. Help people who don't know me, Christ. Be a light in the darkness. Share the good news of the gospel with courage, as a beacon of hope and truth. Love, let your life show how much I love you. Change as you go out into the world and baptize people from every nation, marking them and telling them to do what I told you to do. Stay persistent in prayer. Pray all the time, giving thanks in every. In these situations, prayer is your only way to reach me directly, that you connect your heart with mine and use my power through prayer. Being present, let prayer be a normal and constant part of your life. Whenever you have enough or not enough, believe that I will provide for you. I am your Jehovah. I, the God who gives, know what you need before you ask for it. Ask, and I will do what I can to meet your needs based on how rich I am in praise. Not worry about anything, but pray and ask for help in every case. On Thanksgiving, please tell me what you want. Let love be your main goal. It is kind and patient, and it doesn't anger. It doesn't brag or seem proud. It doesn't put other people down, and it's not. It is self-centered, doesn't get angry easily, and doesn't keep track of when someone loves you. They don't enjoy bad things, but they do enjoy the truth. Love never fails because it always trusts, always hopes, and always keeps going. Remember that I will always be with you until the end of this path. Age, you are my beloved child, and I love seeing you walk in all of peace and love. My love, I am your God and you are mine. You will never be alone. I am with you now and always. Click Amen if you agree and like this movie if you believe in God. To watch more videos, beloved child, I want you to know the truth about the flesh that is sin. Lives within you, it doesn't just go away, it rises and falls. Based on the decisions you make every day when you pray, seek me and decide to live according to. But when you don't do what I say, the power of the flesh gets weaker. When you give in to temptation, your flesh gets stronger. Foothold. Remember that you are not doomed to stay bound to sin. This is a lie the enemy wants you to believe to keep you stuck in sin, hopelessness, and sorrow. But I made you as my child. To live in freedom, holiness, and all of my love. Don't believe the lie that you can't change or get through your problems. Accept the hope and faith that come from knowing me and my promises instead. The fight against the flesh is a daily one, and there will be times when you trip and fall, but don't let those times define you. You or make you give up every time you fall. Come to me and say sorry and let my grace lift you back up. I'm always ready to forgive. Revive you no matter how many times you fall to make your spirit stronger and your body stronger. Immerse yourself in my word. Let it be the base of your life, guiding your words and feelings. Actions. As you think about my truth and use it in your life, you will find the strength and smarts to resist temptation and live in a way that makes me happy. We were made for community, with other Christians who can encourage and help you on your path. And when you have Christian friends who can pray with you, hold you responsible, and tell you the truth, it gets easier to fight the flesh in real life. Remember that the goal is not perfection, but rather a process of change that never ends. 
Change will happen as you give me your life and let my spirit work for you. Your body's wants and needs will start to lose their power over you. If you follow what God says, you will find new joy and peace. Me, but this change doesn't happen all at once. It happens over time. That needs persistence, patience, and a determination to keep going. Even when things are hard, you'll sometimes want to give up when the pull of the in those moments flesh seems too strong to fight back. Cling to me and my promises. Keep in mind that you are a new person because of Christ and that the old has died. When you're weak, remember that my weakness makes my strength stronger. Lean on me and let my power work for you. Through you, I'll give you the kindness and strength you need to get through anything dreadful or fight, and if you fail, don't wallow in shame and guilt. This is how the enemy tries to keep you stuck in a cycle of loss. Instead, run to me. Since I love you the same way I always have, I will always welcome you back. As you continue on this road, with open arms ready to forgive and heal of faith, Keep your eyes on me. I am the one who wrote and finished your have faith, and I will finish the good work I started with you. Trust in my love, grace, and power. Power to make your life better from the inside out. Remember that you're not fighting this. You will never be alone in battle because I am with you always and have given you the Holy Spirit to lead you. To feel better and give you strength, Lean on me and let me lead you. Enter the rich life I have planned for you. It won't always be simple, but it will always be worth it. You will find a new way to live as you learn to walk in the Spirit and fight the flesh. You will find a level of freedom and joy you never thought possible. You will learn the beauty of living a life in surrender to, I want a life with meaning, hope, and love. So please don't give up, my child. Moving forward with the knowledge that I will be with you the whole way. I will never leave you or forsake you. I love you and will always love you. Trust me and watch as I change your life and use you for my glory. But know that you are not defined by, no matter what problems or sins you have, my love for you and that you are my loving child. Accept this truth and let it be the base of your life. I'm proud of you and cheering you on. On, keep looking for me, keep trusting me, and keep walking in line with me. As you do this, you will find the power to beat the flesh and live. A life full of plenty. I've called you my child. Always remember that you are never, when you're by yourself, I'll show you the wonders I have in store for you. You only need to trust me, and I'll fix you for your health and spirit. So today I tell you, my child, to get strong and rise, don't fall, keep going, and hold on to your faith. I will give you everything you ask for. Don't let hopelessness or doubt take over, and don't let the noise of the world bother you. Take your attention away from your road. Trust me, and I promise you that a profound miracle is waiting for you. Keep your faith strong and keep going toward what you want. Don't be afraid of the challenges that lie ahead. Going ahead, I'm going to finish the good work I started with you. Great things to happen in your life so you can reach all your goals and live a happy life enjoying good health and more gifts than you can imagine. Remember everything with me, are possible, and I always keep my promises. Keep going, my child, and never. Please don't forget that the age of miracles is still going on. I am still here doing miracles. Wonders that turn the impossible into strong proofs of my love, and as you face each day with strength, Know that I am deeply involved in every moment of your life. Carefully planned your day's events 
and every move you make has been thought through with divine even if the world around you seems to be in a mess because of its, if you're in a fallen state, know that this doesn't change how perfect my plan is for the fact that you can see the chaos breaking at the edges shows to how broken the world is. But in the middle of this disorder, you can expect to face problems, but these problems are not signs of my absence, but chances for you to EXP have my presence in a perfect way, way, even when things aren't great, as you make your way through your day, remember that I'm always with you, and let the Holy Spirit lead you. Every step you take protects you from needless challenges and gives you the tools you need to deal with the ones that are bound to happen as you wade through the M of this broken world. Let me take your mind to heavenly places. You feel peace and joy there because I'm there with you. I also want to be free from the problems of this world. At the center of your whole being when your attention is fixed on me, my peace will replace your fears and worries. These worries keep going around and around in your mind. Looking to get into your heart, stay alert, and let trust and gratitude be. Your fear is pushed away by guards before it can take hold. Remember that there is no fear in my, take some time to sit quietly in the love that shines through your life all the time. The brightness of my love light as you do, I will give you a peace that shines with divine light and make your whole being trust and love. This turning thing isn't just a brain game for me, it involves your whole spirit and soul. If you hold your body in this position of total dependence, you will see that my love is not inactive. It works to change everything about your life and how you treat other people to reflect the love and care I have for you. Have shown you to be kind and understanding, because many people are fighting their own fears in silence. During hard times, what you say and do can give someone hope and comfort. Just like I'm here with you, you can be there for other people by listening and saying something calming that shows you care. Also, my love, practice thanks every day. By recognizing the good things I've done for you, you shift your focus from lack to abundance. Abundance. This shift is strong. It changes not only how you feel inside, but also changes how you interact with the world around you. Being thankful lets you make you happy and strengthens your faith, even when in trouble when you need to make a choice or aren't sure what to do. Ask me for advice. I'm not a faraway God. I am a loving Father ready to give advice. Pray for wisdom. Listen for my direction, which often comes to you in whispers and through the things that happen to you. As you make choices that are in line with my divine knowledge, you will be able to get through life, your way with more peace and confidence. Also think about the effect of your spiritual practices are daily prayer, meditation on my word, and getting together with other believers. Aren't just religious duties. They're the very things that keep you close to my heart. These routines are your spiritual food, keeping your soul healthy, getting ready for the tasks and chances that lie ahead as you continue your journey. Remember that trials may happen, but they do so for a reason. Every problem is an opportunity to depend on me more. These times will test your faith, but they also make it stronger, like how fire makes gold stronger. Take advantage of these chances knowing I'm using them to make you better and more like the person I called you to be. Let me remind you of the joy that there is deep joy in knowing that living a life in line with my will brings me that you are following the path I have shown you, a road that leads to. As you walk this road, you will find happiness and meaning. Find my gifts in unexpected places and have moments of grace that remind you of my loving care, 
I am your loyal guardian and wise advisor, and your happy friend Ion. May these facts give you strength and courage as you face each day. Amen. Hear what I say and hold on to this good news revelation deep in your heart, my dear child. Know how much I love you. I love you, and hearing your declarations of love makes me feel good. Immense joy. Every time you tell me you love me, our friendship gets stronger. In many ways, through my healing words, keep you safe from harm and rescue from danger, I have shown you how much I love you. I am your stronghold, the one who keeps promises, the one who lifts the downtrodden, the one who strengthens the weak, the one who brings happiness to those who are sad and opens the heavens, open gates for those who give their whole hearts and minds to me and follow my ways. Understand how very important it is to respect, be patient, and they don't engage in rumors, fights, lies, or deception. These are my beloved children, who choose to live in my presence and stay on this road without wavering. You are still among them, my child. My words are still in your mind, are written on your heart in a way that can't be changed. They give you the strength to withstand any task, beat any enemy, and stand up to every. It makes me happy to see how seriously you take our chances. Relationship. You get braver and stronger every day, which makes me happy. I'm greatly increasing your mental vision, which will allow you to see the vast. I'm about to shower you with a lot of good things. But be aware that in outside of this world, there are forces that want to hurt you and your family. But don't worry, they're not real. I protect you with my grace, which is sealed by the power of my, the sacrifice shields you to be careful in what you do and kind in how you treat others. No matter what happens, words don't give in to anger or act without thinking. Keep in mind that I have your family and you in my arms when things go wrong. To answer with patience and kindness, and my peace will grow in your home, you will see many wonders get unexpected good luck and see your faith has made you stronger and your loved ones will be surrounded by deep love. Joy, I will say it again. I love you and I will always be with you surround you. I'm speeding up the arrival of your blessings and making sure that the solutions you seek will get to you soon, dear child. Know that everything in your life is being made to help you, so keep your mind and heart open. I want to come into your home. Please open the doors and let me in. Your homes today, listen to me, and believe that your life is about to change. I know what you need even before they even form in your mind. I want you to be able to clearly explain your hopes and dreams to just tell me what you want and where you want to go. Take heart. Success is within reach, but it will require real faith and passionate prayers. After hard work and many personal compromises, I promise to give you a long-term success that will make you and your family rich one that doesn't sadness or pulls you away from me. And I don't want your family to suffer while you're away to see you succeed in the world. But when you bring shadows home, you forget about your having stressed out loved ones that is bad for your health. I know the path of justice isn't always easy, my sweet child. Many things in the world will try to take you wrong, but I'm here to show you the way aid you in understanding how sin works and giving you the tools to fight it. Sin often comes in appealing forms to get people to give in to their fleshly wants, the desire of the eyes and the satisfaction of one's own work. In the Garden of Eden, Eve was tempted by the same things. The snake told her that the the banned fruit was good for you in terms of food that looks good and getting smarter, but when you ate it, 
This pattern of temptation still exists, even though she and Adam brought sin and death into the world. Today, you might be drawn to physical pleasures that seem harmless but can lead you into addiction and hurting the relationships you have. You may want to buy things or status because you think they will make you happy and safe, but you find if you're always wanting more, you might be proud of your own skills and accomplishments, forgetting that every good gift comes from I forgive you. But I have not left you helpless against these temptations. I have given you a strong, my word is a weapon. Hide it in your heart so that might not sin against me when you are tempted. Do not argue with your own wants or with the enemy's lies. Just read what's in the Bible. Are you tempted to give in to the desire of the body? Remember that your body is a home for the Holy Spirit that you paid for and is meant to honor God. Me. Are you tempted to want material things or fame? Don't forget that your life isn't about how many things you have and that I will meet all your needs. Are you tempted to be proud of your own wealth and fame because of mine? Remember that you can't do anything without me and that I'm against being proud. Give kindness to those who are humble. My word lives and works. It can cut through thinking like a double-edged sword and is very sharp. Hearts to tell the difference between truth and lies and to lead you in the right way to go, but it's only powerful if you know it and believe it and use it, which is why I want you to engage yourself in Scripture. Read it study it, and think about it every day and night. Let it shape who you are. When you do this, your ideas, feelings, and actions will be like a tree placed by a stream that bears fruit in season and has leaves that don't die. You'll be able to handle the storms of temptation and, as you grow in your faith, know this, my child, I am not. I have given you my Holy Spirit to fight this battle by yourself, lead you to the truth to help you remember what I've said, and to give you strength. You can live a godly life if you depend on His power instead of your own. Please don't give up if you trip and fall. I am a God of second chances, of kindness and grace. Tell me about your sins, and I will forgive you you and to wash away all your sins. My love for you is not based on how well you do, but on how I do. Characters that don't change and the work that Christ did on the cross. So stand strong in your faith. With the truth of my words, fight the devil and he will run away from you. Come close to me and I will come close to you. Near to you, I will never leave you or forsake you. I will finish the good work I began with you. You have to fight sin every day, but you can win, because God is with you. But remember, my child, that this world is not your home, a citizen of heaven, and your final fate is to become like me. One day, the battle will be over and you'll stand before me pure and shining as a sign of my grace. Until then, fight the good fight of faith and hold on to the spiritual life you were called to. Don't put up with what other people think. This world, but be changed by having your mind renewed. Be a living sacrifice and offer your body to God. Don't give up, and whenever you feel like it, know that I am with you. Prayer Hold on to my word and lean on my everlasting arms. I will give you strength for today and a bright hope for tomorrow. I will lead you in the right way for my name's sake. Trust me with all your heart and don't depend on your own. Understanding all of your ways, give them to me and I'll make your way. I see you, my dear child. I am your God and I will never let you down. I know you're dealing with the weight of sin and feel stuck in a cycle of sin, 
but I want you to know that there is no change in my love for you. I am here to lead you back to the road of it is right to listen to the Holy Spirit when it tells you something. Don't ignore it or push it away. Being found guilty is not a punishment. It is a gift of my mercy. It is a warning that I am always with you, pushing you to do what is good and right. May the conviction of the Holy Spirit guide you. It may come to you in the form of a whisper or a strong understanding. Feel uneasy about what you're doing or become aware of how bad what you're doing is. This is a sign that I want you to come back to me. Don't be afraid to face your sins head on and tell me about them without holding back. I already know all of your deepest secrets, and I can't wait for you to share them with my love when you can. When you admit you did something wrong, a heavy weight will be taken off your shoulders. You will feel relieved that you were honest, and my kindness will wash over you. You will be free, getting rid of all that is wrong with you. Remember, my child, that I'm not a stern judge ready to punish you. I'm your loving father, and I want what's best for you, for your health and wholeness. I see the good that can come from you even when you can't. See it for yourself. If you follow the Holy Spirit's lead, you will find the strength to stay away from sinful habits. Every time you choose what's right will help you stay strong in your faith and draw you closer to me. Heart. This path of change won't always be easy. There will be times when you, even if you trip and fall, don't let shame or defeat stop you from running. I'll always be here to welcome you back into my arms. My love is gentle, kind, and always ready to welcome you home, no matter how many times you fall. We'll always be there to help you get back on your feet. As you walk in my will, you will find a peace and joy that beyond what we can understand, your life will bear the fruit of the spirit of love, happiness, peace, patience, goodness, the virtues of loyalty, kindness, and self-control will come. Other people will see them from your heart as easily as water flows from a pure fountain. You need to change and let the light of my love shine through you. Don't settle for average. I have called you to a life full of plenty, whether you answer with faith or a half-hearted promise. Purpose. Have faith in my plans for you, even when they take you through rough spots. Shadow. I will never leave you or forget about you. My love will hold your hand and lead you, keep you going, and my kindness will give you the strength to get through anything that comes your way. Way for my dear child to hear the words of the Holy Spirit inside you. Let my conviction lead you to turn away from sin, and my love lead you to goodness. I am with you always, leading you to a future full of hope. Blessing. Tell me your sins without fear, because I will forgive you, cleanse you of all that is wrong. My mercy is new every morning and my love for you will never end. If you fail, as long as you follow my Spirit's lead, you will find freedom. If you walk in the joy that comes from doing what I say, you will become a live testimony of my power to change things, a light in this world's darkness. Don't be. Are you scared of the problems that lie ahead? I will give you the strength and knowledge you need for each one. Trust in my goodness, lean on my kindness, and build your life on my love. Of your life, I am your father, your friend, and your savior. I love you and am happy for you, over you with songs of love. You are valuable to me, and I will never give up fighting for you. So, my child, bring all your worries and fears to me and lay them at my feet. Put your feet on my peace and I'll make your way clear and your heart whole. Don't forget that my love for you is a gift, 
not based on how well you do or how perfect you are, because I love you no matter what, not your sins, not your mistakes, not even your I am with you in the valley, on top of the mountain, in the dark, and in the light, my love, will get you through every hard time and into eternal happiness. You must repent, my dear child. To repent means to change your mind. Sin is more than just feeling sorry for yourself, wrongdoings, but a big change in how you think about them. It's about getting your thoughts in line with how I think about sin, seeing how bad it is, and making a promise to stay away from it altogether. When you truly turn away from sin, you start to see it as I do. If you know that it keeps you from me and causes harm and destruction, repentance means a deep understanding of how wrong sin is in your life and the lives of others. A sincere promise to give up and turn away from it is to change your. In my mind, it means giving up old ways of thinking and starting a new life that fits with my will. This change begins in your mind. It's about understanding the making the choice to take a path that leads to life and the need for change peace, give up sin by giving up on it. After you've repented, the next step is to turn away from sin. It means making a conscious effort to change how you act in the world. It means making smart decisions to stay away from things and people that make you into temptation. Think about the things that make you sin. What habits, relationships, or places that make your problems worse? Figure them out and do something about them. Getting rid of them from your life means surrounding yourself with good people who encourage you to grow in faith and righteousness, and your deeds should show what you've learned. Mindset It's not enough to say you're sorry. You have to show it. Act in a way that shows your commitment. Look for chances to do good. To help other people and grow in your relationship with me, you need to know that repentance is a continuous process. It's not a one-time thing. It's a daily choice to stay away from sin and turn to me every day. Cleanse your mind by spending time in my word and in prayer and let my truth lead your actions and thoughts. Remember that I am with you on this trip. You are not alone, perfect when you're weak. If you need help, just ask me, and I'll give you the kindness you need. I want you to live a life of happiness and joy, free from the chains that hold you back. Of sin, you are my loving child and I want the best for you to enjoy the freedom that comes from having your mind and heart changed by turning away from your sins and trust in my love and kindness. Even if you trip, know that I am here to lift you up. My mercy is new every morning, will never leave you or forsake you. Come to me with a heart that is sorry, and I will forgive you, give you rest, as you walk this path of repentance, you'll start to see the good things that happen when you live. If you do what I want, your life will be a sign of my favor. Power People will notice how you've changed and be drawn to me. Stay on this road and don't give up. Don't give up when things go wrong or fail. They're just chances for... If you want to grow and learn... Trust that I am working in you and through you to get my, because I want you to feel my love and presence more deeply as you continue to. Your relationship with me will grow if you turn away from sin. You will be stronger, and you will feel the peace and joy that come from living a life that pleases me. I am with you all the time. Lean on me every step of the way and find strength in my promise. You are my beloved child, and I look forward to seeing you grow. Make changes and keep going with faith and trust. Your path to repentance is a beautiful way to show your love for me and your desire to live a life that respects me. Keep looking for me 
and I will keep leading and blessing you. Accept this new way of living and thinking, and let it change every part of your life. You're on your way to more freedom and happiness. Trust me, love, and forgiveness. You will see changes for the better in your life. I love you, my child. Rest in my love and let it change you. You're never alone. I'm with you now and as always. My dear child, if you want to really break free from sin, you have to make a, make a firm choice to change your life. This means taking action and keeping away from things that could lead you wrong might require you to change your setting to get away from things that make you want to be with someone else instead of my love. It's not always easy to do this, but you need to for your mental growth. Well-being. Be disciplined in your daily life and hold yourself to high standards. Follow them. Take responsibility for what you do and look to. Hold yourself accountable by surrounding yourself with people who share your faith and values. Will help and guide you on your path to living a life that makes you happy. I want to remind my child that getting rid of sin is a big deal. May sometimes need to take bold steps, but know that I am with you every step of the way. By the way, my love for you is unconditional, and my kindness is enough. Through even the hardest times so that you can stay free from sin, you need to stay emotionally alert, which means setting aside time every when temptation comes calling. Spend the day in prayer and reading my word. Don't think about it. Run away from it and come to me. I will be your safe place the truth of my word every day to keep your spirit strong. Let it be the base on which as you go through life, remember Bible verses that speak to you and think of them when, when you feel weak or open. My word is a lamp to your feet and a light to your way, that you should go find friends and teachers you can trust who will walk with you on your faith journey. Be honest with them about the hard times in your let them speak truth into your life and hold you responsible. Victories are what we were made for. Our community and we can only grow with the help and support of others. Thrive. You will trip and fall sometimes, but my love for you will never change. Always be there to help you get back on track. Paths. As you walk with me, you'll see that the chains of sin start to form. When they let go of you, you'll feel a freedom and joy that can only be found in giving up your life to me. Your life will be a testimony to my power to change things. It is a shining example of what it means to live in the light of my love. So don't worry, my child. You are not, I'm with you in this fight, and I've given you everything you need to live a life. Victory. Put your faith in my power, my kindness, and the freedom I give you, have bought for you. Remember that the enemy will try to stop you. They will tell you lies and try to persuade you that you don't deserve my love and that you can never be free of. Those are lies, though. The truth is that I love you, child and nothing will ever be able to separate you from my love when those lies come. Say out loud, Who are you in me? A new creation, based on the truth of my words, holy and good, saved and set free. Remember what I promised you. I promise that my love for you will never end as you continue on this road. We'll find that your wants start to change things that used to be important to you. Appeal will lose its shine and you'll find happiness and satisfaction. The work of my spirit inside me is to live a life that respects me, changing you from the inside out. Accept this process, even if it's hard. It's hard to believe that I'm using every battle, temptation, and victory to make you into the person I made you to be. You are still being worked on, which is a good thing, so keep going. Moving forward, my child, 
keep your eyes on me and your heart open to me. We are not going on your trip to freedom by yourself. It is a journey we are taking together. I will never leave you or forsake you, hand in hand. My love for you is firm. It's true. And as long as you walk with me and choose freedom over sin, you will find that my happiness is what makes you strong. You can do it, child, not because you are strong or determined, but because of the power that my power lives inside you. Lean into that power and trust it, and watch as I do a million times more than you could ever dream. I love you forever. I love you and will be with you every step of the way on this trip. Give up your doubts, lean on me, and let me lead you to the rich life I have, a life of freedom, joy, and meaning for you. I have a wonderful future in store for you, one that is free from sin and pain and full of my presence. Never lose sight of that eternal hope, my love. Let it be the center of your life. Soul, until then, keep walking with me, keep choosing freedom, and keep going after it. Just, and know that I am always loving you, leading you, and cheering you on every step of the way. In any case, you are my beloved child, and I am proud of you no matter what. And I can't wait to see what I do in and through you as you go on this journey of faith, Remember that my grace is enough for you and my strength is made perfect in your weakness, so don't let your problems get you down. Don't let your problems define you. Instead, let my mistakes remind you of how much you need me and drive me. I love you more and more. I am with you, my child. I am for you, and I will stay that way. Do not stop working on your life. It is shaping you and driving you. Watch as I change your life and let you enjoy all the freedom I have for you. One step at a time, one day at a time, and one one choice at a time. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel to reach 5,000 divine subscribers very soon. Please share this video. Type Amen to affirm. Thanks for watching.